Hi, welcome to Real Magic Review. My name is Steve Faulkner and today I will be reviewing Hofdinzer's Dream, which I can't actually say. Before I do that, can you please like, subscribe, check out Card Magic Course. That's my online card magic course of hundreds of videos. Learn from a pro. I made this started making this in 2013 and I'm still going and there's just so much on it. It's such a great resource. Uh, but don't take my word for it. I'm biased. Have a look at the testimonials on cardmagiccourse.com. Thank you very much. Right. Um, but I've had to re-record this, uh, <laughs> this review because there's something I didn't realise about this. Um, so I, I was, you know, when I started the last review that I recorded that you're never going to see by saying I think Vanishing Inc. have finally done it. I think they finally sent me something that I'm um, a little bit disappointed with. I still am, but slightly less. I'll explain. So this, Benny Chickering's a very good gaff card maker. And uh, this is a gaff card that allows you to show the, the show their chosen card. Um, maybe it's a four, uh, it would be in this case the four of diamonds. I think in all cases four of diamonds. Uh, and, then sh and then hold it against a light. Uh, shake it and you can see the silhouette of the diamonds move and transform into the card that they chose. Now that's cool, isn't it? I like these kind of weird ghostly effects where things move around in the car and then you show that there's clearly no sort of, there's no mechanics. This is the actual card. There's no mechanics or anything like that on it. So that is, that is cool. Um, the problem I had with it was that I couldn't see the thing. I was shining my phone through it. I was shining a light through it and I just couldn't, there was a faint glimpse. I thought that's not very magical. They're not, they, they can't actually see it. And uh, so I did give this quite a sniffy review. Now I'm still don't think it's I don't think it's great. The the, the good things are it is a well made gimmick. Benny Chickering is a very good gaff maker. It's not quite. It, I mean, it's as well made as it can get. And and Kyle does say on the um, on the ad that, that he kind of says when you open this you're going to be stunned. Uh, and it's and it, it, it's that's a bit over the top. I think I think if you're stunned at this and you you know it, you should probably get out a little bit more. Doesn't take away from how well it's made. It looks like a playing card and it does a cool thing. Um, and it does look like I mean even if you pick it up, there's nothing there except the thing that makes it do the thing, uh, which is all good. But we still have the issue. Up is the it's all easy. It's all good. It's all simple. It, it, what it, it I was going to say it does what it says, but. I couldn't see the thing working because I had the lights on. Now, in the, in the trailer, it does. It's in the dark, so it does show you when it works. But you you're kind of limited to when you can do it. Now, I will, without a doubt, if I'm sitting around with my mates, I'll go like, I'll show you something really cool. Turn the lights off, and I'll get that ghostly kind of that thing happening, uh, which I think is you can build that up to quite a quite a nice moment, I think, and then you show them the cards changed. I'll do that. I'll happily do that. I'll do that tomorrow if, if I'm in a situation and go, turn the lights off. But I'm not in that situation very much when I'm performing. Uh, so, <laughs> so unless it's quite dark, which let's be honest, it is quite often, isn't it? Um, so if I'm at a dark place, I, I might do something like this. Um, other than that, it, it's not as practical as I thought, but it's certainly not as bad as I thought it was when I was thinking it basically doesn't work. And then I was thinking that's, sorry, my email's just gone off. Sorry. Um, I thought it'd be unusual for Vanishing to, you know, they're kind of on it with this. But so, but you do need to know you need darkness for it. The other slight downside, <clears throat> excuse me, is that it's, um, you don't finish clean. Now, when you do something and everybody's sitting around the dark and you show them the card, the fact that it's dark means you can get away with a few things. Um, so you can finish clean with it. But it, as you show that, you, you're not, it looks clean, and then, but if someone grabs for it, you know, the usual stuff. It, not really a problem for me with audience management, um, but that's it. But that's, it's okay. It's a nicely made thing. It's a nice moment, um, but uh, I'll, I'll be interested to in see if I actually get a chance to, to play with it in front of, of an audience. So that's Hofsins' dream. Uh, any questions, do comment below because I do answer your comments on the comments on comments section on uh, Thursday evenings at 5 UK. So... Uh, whenever this happens, comment any questions and I'll answer all the questions I can on that Thursday session. Uh, so thank you very much. Uh, you've been watching Real Magic Review. Please like, subscribe, check out cardmagiccourse.com. Have a wonderful day and take care. Cheers.